Hey y'all, it's Bruce. Wanted to give a quick shop update today. Today is Sunday morning about uh, 9 o'clock and I'm happy to already be in the shop. I uh, can't spend the whole day here but at least it's an early start. Anyway, um, wanted to let you know what's been happening in the shop and what I'm going to plan to do in the next week or two. So first thing that's new, you may have noticed just right behind me, I have bought a drill press. So I'm super happy about that and actually today I'm probably going to make a video about uh, setting this up and seeing how it works. Second thing is, is I have some new furniture in the shop. Let me show you. First I have this uh, old coffee table. It's an Ikea and so I'm planning to make a workbench out of this. I may just use the top only and just kind of build out a box and the reason for that is because I do have this one but it's a bit lightweight and it's a bit too tall for you know all purposes uh, so I'm planning maybe to leave the uh, drill press on this one and then use this one as more of a general workbench so we'll see I'm not sure about that but probably that's what's going on with that one over here are also two IKEA uh, bathroom stands or something and I'm just using them to store w w some of the wood and some rags and some other things like that. It looks a little bit more organized than how I had it just all on the ground before. Uh, the other piece is this uh, other bathroom rack and right now I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it but I have the uh, stereo in there but I'll surely put something else on top. Also I've acquired some bikes. Let me show you. Well not this one, this is my mountain bike but this one here <clears throat> and these two children's bikes. These were all being given away by the same person. It was uh, sitting at the bottom of their driveway with a free sign on them. And uh, they're not too, too bad. Uh, this one here, I'm planning to fix up and send to Benin as part of a charity project that I've been working for for the past few years. Um, it does need a little bit of work, but it's mostly usable already. The main biggest thing I've noticed that it needs uh, work with is the head tube bearings or head bearings or something's wrong with them. I don't know what, but uh, also the back tire is really, you know, totally shot. So, um, that's that. Then these two children ones, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with both of them. But definitely at least one of them is going to turn into a bike trailer. The other just small thing I did was uh, made just punch some holes in this uh, strip here and drop my screwdrivers in there because I was always having to go into my um, toolbox to get them. Also I just glued these little pieces on here to be able to put my hammer out. This I made quite a while ago just to hold some of my clamps. This is a nice setup. I really enjoy this and it's super simple. It's, you know, super ugly and primitive, but uh, it really helps out having all this stuff, you know, quickly available. And it was super easy to make. It took, you know, 10 minutes to cut the wood, glue it all together, drill the holes. I mean, it doesn't get any easier than that. And another thing I did, the last thing I did up here was, um, I've already, I already had this for a while, but I did, I did a little bit of work to it and just kind of set it up slightly more permanently you know I glued this on used to have clamps and stuff and I kind of shaped a V there and shaped a notch here so now for the things that I'm going to do and the things I've wanted to make videos on uh, number one is the the drill press I'm gonna make a video today hopefully about assembling that and using it a little bit uh, you know kind of a review almost uh, the next thing I want to do is work on that bench well it's not really the next thing I want to do but that's one of the things I want to do. The more immediate need to do, to thing to do, is actually work on my mountain bike. Um, I'm entering a race on May 22nd, Bike Day Solitorn, or Solitorn Bike Days, I don't remember. But, um, so I want to get this bike ready for racing. It needs a few things uh, tuned up on it. That's one thing, and I want to do that as soon as possible because now I have about one month, about four weeks until the race starts. The next thing, kind of the highest priority actually, is this bike because uh, my partner in the organization, he uh, told me that we have the opportunity to have either a free or a very low cost uh, 
shipping container. Well, not a whole container, but part of a container that a bigger charity is already sending over to Benin. So um, he doesn't know when when uh, we have to have the bike in the container or the stuff. It's not only the bike, but uh, he said it's pretty soon. So I need to get this thing in decent shape. Okay, thanks for watching and uh, keep an eye out for the other videos. Ciao.